Hello, welcome to another Sonic Racing Cosmos Morning tutorial. In this one, we're going to be editing databases. Now, databases do a lot of things in this game, and they're all basically entirely different from each other, so I cannot possibly cover all of them. So I'm going to be showing you the basic process of editing one, and then you can either ask for help or figure out yourself how to do something with a very specific one if you're having trouble. Uh, for this, we're going to need USA GUI and the Crossroads release US map. You can use the one that came with Retalk Workflow, but that one was the demo, so you should get this one. Lastly, we're going to be using the Retalk uh, game extraction. If you don't have one of those, you can look at the extraction tutorial that I made, since I go through a process I believe at the end of the video. So, without other way, let's start. I'm going to be editing the database that handles the Rebel teams in Team Park mode. So, I'm going to go to the extraction, Union, Content, C1 Union database and it should be in rival here so i'm going to copy this one this, this is the one that has the rivals and we're going to go into our game mod union content we're going to recreate the, the full the, the file path union oops, database and rival i'm going to place this here and i go back and open usgui Now, USA GUI needs the mappings file to be able to properly open things. So we're going to go into utilities and import mappings. And when I get them from, this is the wrong folder. When I get them from wherever you put them, in this case, I have them here. So just double click that and you will see they will add the mappings over here. Now with file open and then go into the mod folder to get the, the database that we copied. Now, you can see there's, this is pretty empty. The thing, the thing we want to is in the export data uh, tab. So open this, open this, uh, open the, the table information, and now you have all the teams here. This is Team Sonic, Team Dark, uh, Team Team Rose, Team Dark, etc. I'm going to be editing Team Dark because that's the one I'm on. In my experience, this specific data table can only have four drivers, so let's add four just for the fun of it. And here you enter the name of the character. This is based on the character's internal ID, which for the most part is always their name. For this, I'm going to be editing this to be Sonic, and this to be, I don't know, SPO, and this to be Metal Sonic. Now we can save and we can test this uh, editing game. However, there is more to be to go through with this. Uh, you, you can see there's a lot of things here. For the most part, the, when, when it's a string table entry, the, the, the first value is going to be the path to the file. In this case, it's looking for the file database rebel team data in game and voice switch database game data and it's looking for this specific string if we open f model one second if we open f model and we go into this file path which is union content voice bridge database game data and we open it we'll see that there's actually nothing here because this is this is actually pulling the text from the localization but you can see that there's the key and the entry are both the same you can see the entry matches the one over here so now if we go into the localization for the text and we look for this we should find the name of the team in this case team dark Right. So, so once you're done doing all your edit, you can either do Control S or simply with the file and save. Now we can go into here. You can delete the backups if you wanted to. I'm going to do it because I know I didn't do anything wrong. You can go back, repack the mod. In repack mod underscore P. Properties, install game files, browse. Union content packs and paste it here. For the close F model. All right, testing game. Again, it's very hard to teach how to actually edit data tables because each data table and data asset and database are, are basically entirely different from each other. So you choose at that one, you just have to have uh, practice and pay attention to what the file does to know what it's obviously doing and how to edit it correctly. But this is going to give you like a general idea of what to do and how to do it. So let's now if we see in game that if we go into the race park, the 
team uh, team tag should be a team of four people and it should be the characters that we set you see here the four variables are the, char are the characters that are set up in the database now this is the, this database specifically uh, the game looks for the character you set but actually it loads the, the ai racer for obvious reasons but yeah, as you can see it's all working correctly and all all four racers are in the race and that's the entire process for editing databases if you need help with a specific database you can ask for help in the, in the modding discord but obviously there's no guarantee somebody has messed with that database yet for example or anything of the sort or you can try to figure out on your own if you really wanted to